Ribbit, ribbit. Today we're going to talk about frogs. Stop out of frogs. This is Roger the Smiling Bass Hall. Bass love frogs. And frogs come in a huge number of varieties. Here's one with these uh, 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 rubber band like for legs. Doesn't matter. It still makes the same action. Here's a tip that somebody gave me. Uh, cut them off so that one of them is a little uneven. It makes it even more enticing to the bass. These are all weedless like the other weedless uh, bait, bait topwater reefs we were talking about. The plastic protects the, the hooks from the weeds. They will get hung up occasionally, but don't worry. Just pull them out uh, and uh, they'll go. This is a lunker frog here. This one has a little weight right here so that when it sits in the water, it sits just like a frog does. It's very enticing to the bass and looks just like a frog. This one is very realistic. On the other hand, we have something like this. Not quite so realistic, but it's uh, very um, attractive. Again, it has the little uh, weight to make it sing like this. And again, this one only has the one hook, the one hook uh, on, the, uh, on the back uh, to uh, keep it from getting hum hung up in the weeds. So you can really throw it into some weeds. And when you swim it, the legs move much like a frog. Frogs come in all different sizes and shapes. This one has both those uh, rubber uh, uh, danglies and some legs there. So uh, they come in all different shapes and sizes because so do frogs. Here's a little one, the same uh, lunker frog, uh, but uh, a smaller version. Very uh, realistic looking to the fishermen and to the bass. The bass love uh, frogs and they will eat them when they can. Uh, so uh, this is a great one for a big bass. But you know, a bass's mouth is very big and uh, scientists have discovered that they use their back muscles to um, create the suction that they need to get the bait in. So a, a, a bass, not as big as you might think, can still eat a frog this size. That's how they get to be big bass, is uh, eating these kind of uh, foods. So it's a top water. You throw it out, you jerk it again, like all topwaters, you've got to wait. When they grab it, you've got to wait three seconds. How long is three seconds? That's a long time. Yeah, so you have to pause. One, one little tip is, uh, uh, you know, you can always drop your rod, reel in some slack, and then strike. But if you strike too fast, you're just going to push it, pull it right out of its mouth. So look out. But use a frog. Get a frog on. The bass love them. So will you. This is Roger the Smiling Bassel. Tight line.